Hello everybody, it's Ever Ultimate 4 for another episode of Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth. In the last episode we explored more of the grasslands and uh, got ourselves over to uh, Chocobo Ranch here and got ourselves a Chocobo. Uh, we also met Chadley again, I remember him. Uh, who gave us a whole Titan. bunch of stuff to do. Colossus of the grasslands in virtual space. But also that we got I Titan. I encourage you to pit your skills against this summoned entity so that I might complete its materia. And I kind of want it. Uh, use combat simulator. Sorry if you can hear the bird outside. Or if you like it, then I'm not sorry. Well, there's a lot going on here. Uh... So the Titan, three-person battle in which you pick your team, confront the legendary earthrending colossus known as Titan to gauge the Deiform entity's combat prowess. Okay, we need to do a whole bunch much more stuff to unlock those. Healing materia... Wow, there's, there's a lot to do! Okay, guess what we're doing? <laughs> we're doing a lot of stuff. Emerge victorious against these mighty entities in the combat simulator to be rewarded with their summoning material. If an entity is proving too difficult, you can gain advantage by analyzing its corresponding summon s s crystals found around the world. Ooh. Okay, so I don't think we're fighting Titan right now because I... You know what? Let's fight it and die and, you know, see where to go from there. How about that? <laughs> I definitely am going to come back to this after I get it summon crystals, but I will... It sounds like it's going to be in this area. That is such a neat design! Ooh. Uh, let's... Let's assess you. Titanic summon recreated in virtual reality. The legend has it this gargantuan being unleashed an earthquake so great that it caused the entire continent to rise from the seafloor, thereby creating the grasslands as they are known today. This uh, titan is actually Groudon. Uh, weak to wind, exploiting its elemental weaknesses, blocking or evading certain attacks, and counterattacking will pressure it, destroying its barrier will pressure it for longer than usual. Okay, this guy is definitely doing a lot. It's on now. Okay. Uh, what spells? Who has... Okay, you guys just... Oh. Uh, I should probably heal myself. Leave me alone, leave me alone. Earth and Roar. Uh, what do you have? You have Arrow. Be blown away. Looks there we go. Ooh. Darn you, Thwacky. This might be it. Yeah, I have a feeling. I have a feeling that I... You know, this is one of those things that's like technically possible, but absolutely not. <laughs> All right, uh, let's just give up over here. We won't waste your time. Uh, I will do the other things, though. Challenge failed, oh no. No, I don't think I'm gonna re-challenge him, thank you. All right, so let's start at the bottom here. A uh, series of three-person battles for Cloud, Barrett, and Tifa. Participate in training exercises to learn how best to utilize synergy skills and abilities. You do not need to have these un unlock these commands to participate. Participate in combat simulators training exercises to learn not only ins and outs, but how to best utilize each party member. More such exercises will become available as new allies join your team. Some of these simulations allow you use abilities you don't have yet. Cool. I think I'm probably going to speed through the actual battle parts of this. Uh, just because it is literally just battles. It's less for you and more for me. Uh, synergy skills. While guarding with R1, you can team up with allies to perform synergy skills. Doesn't consume ATB, but fills it. 
uh, differ depending on the character controlled, and can range from powerful attacks to defensive maneuvers. Uh, types of synergy skills. Uh, combo skills like bullet batter, for example, can be activated immediately with a simple button press. So repeatedly press the button to continue the combo. Others like power cleave require you to hold down the button to charge up power, then release to execute attack. Press the button just as enemy attacks to activate skills like counterfire. We got this. Okay, alright, so far. You know, let's let's change. What do you have here? Uh bullet batter. Come on. With me. Now. Okay, so that's what counter fires. Okay, uh <laughs> Okay, I see what's going on. So bullet batter. Um <laughs> Cloud is Smacking the bullets onto enemies. That's actually kind of awesome. Counterfire was was supposed to be used new when the enemy was attacking, but I was pressing the wrong button. Recovered 50% HP and MP. Okay. So what do you have? You have soaring flurry. Utilizing ATB commands marked with a whatever will grant character synergy. When two characters share enough synergy, you can activate their synergy abilities. Not only deal tremendous damage, but apply buffs. Repeat use of a synergy ability will increase the amount of synergy required to activate it. Thus, it is in your interest to use a variety of these commands rather than concentrate on just one. Good to go. On it. Couldn't have gone any better. Okay, that's kind of cool. Uh, back to cloud. Uh, power cleave. So I kind of have to be closer. Now, coming. Uh, let's go back to bullet batter. Yeah. See that? It worked. Ready? Come on, come on, attack me. Bring it. Do it with ya. Gotcha. Yeah. yeah, these guys keep going away, it's not nice. Ready? With me. Aha! Okay, so using the synergy skills also seems to like make your party members like you more, which is nice. That was cool. No time to celebrate. I like that counter fire a lot. Timing's gonna be weird, but we got steadfast block materia. Uh, next up, red thirteen solo battles for red thirteen. Okay. I guess it's just teaching us how to use red thirteen, which we did already. Hey, it's got his theme. Uh, I think we saw this already. Yeah, it is his theme. Or the, you know. Yeah, it is his theme. Uh, the, you know, Cosmo Canyon. Starting ability, Sidewinder. Guarding against the attacks. Well, Sentinel Stance is activated, fills the Vengeance Gauge. Not enough? I have it. Okay, beautiful. Guarding against attacks fills a vengeance gauge. Consumed with triangle to enter vengeance mode, increases power and dodge speed. Press triangle to use siphon fang, damaging opponent, absorbing HP. What command? 
What abilities do I have? Uh. Yeah, look at that. Keep it coming. Going in. I have nowhere to run. Going in. Had enough? That's wonderful. I love him. Okay, cool. Yeah. It's more or less repeating the things that we got before, like the um, tutorials we got before, but it's still nice. In case we haven't used the enemy yet, uh, the the character yet, and we get a reward out of it, so cool. Yeah, so now it's time for Aerith challenges. What is this music? Press square to unleash long range attacks. Charge tempest. Soldier and Sorcerer's Storm, yeah. I'd keep my distance if I were you. Ha! Uh -huh. Go on, okay. We'll make it quick. Mind backing off a bit. That wasn't so bad. <laughs> I love it. This is like cyberpunk music. Do, 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 do. Yeah, it's like a version of the magic thing. Arcane Ward uh, automatically casts attack spell twice. Yeah, it can also warp. Uh, Come on. Get, Get, Get ready. That's it, guys. That's it. I'd keep my distance if I were you. Yeah. Huh. Huh. You'll see. Get up. Get ready. Huh. Like I could use Arcane Ward, or I could just keep hey, spamming this. It? <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. So what you get for trying to attack the healer. I This music, the the victory music, sounds like it's from Thousand Year Door, doesn't it? At least to me. <laughs> okay, Tifa time! Solo battles for Tifa! Hey, remember my original Final Fantasy VII Let's Play when I kept calling her Tifa and it drove people crazy? I do. Guess we haven't seen these yet, so I'll actually read this. Uh, close range combat uses quick combos. Press square to execute normal attack. Hold it down for a single powerful blow after dodging, uh, attack after dodging to unleash a sweeping strike capable of hitting multiple opponents. Tifa's initial abilities are Unbridled Strength and Focus Strike. Unbridled Strength increases her chi level and grants temporary access to more triangle techniques. Higher chi levels increases the number of standard attacks Tifa can chain together, as well as improve her evasion. Focus Strike, she leaps backwards out of harm's way and then deals a powerful strike that staggers, uh, fills a foe's stagger gauge. Successfully dodging attack will fill her ATB gauge. Note that Tifa will use Unbridled Strength when equipped with an auto-unique ability materia. Uh, sure. Yeah, Ami Strike is great. Uh, let's use Dive Kick. <laughs> I love, I love using her. I, I loved using her in the last game, and I'm gonna love using her in this game. Round two. 
Uh, pressing triangle unleash one of Tifa's martial arts skills such as whirling uppercut. Unbridled strength ability increases the chi level, making more advanced techniques. Omni strike with two and rise and fall with three. Utilizing advanced technique expends one level of chi. Hitting staggered foe with advanced techniques will increase the damage multiplier. I love watching multiplier. It makes such great mo uh, videos on YouTube. Yeah, that did a lot. Not bad. Beautiful. But not my best. Anything new to tell me? Variety of abilities, increase damage multipliers, pressing triangle will unleash whirling up whatever, unique abilities, increase stagger damage, try staggering a foe by landing a focus strike or exploiting a weakness, then going in for the kill with an advanced technique. Ow. Uh, what's... Blizzard? Nope. Oh yes. Okay. Stagger, yeah. There we go. Beautiful. No surprises there. Ice materia. Alright, and finally for that, I mean, I guess there's Cloud, but Barret! Barret's fun. Always good to have long range characters. Uh, Barret specializes in range attacks, allowing him to strike enemies that Cloud cannot reach. Press try a square to shoot or hold the button down to release a sustained burst of automatic fire. Lock onto foes with R3 to blast them. Uh, Barrett's initial abilities are Steel Skin and Maximum Fury. Steel Skin reduces damage taken and makes him less likely to be interrupted. Maximum Fury consumes all available ATB and unleashes a hail of bullets. More ATB consumed, the more potent it becomes. Yeah. Let's use Maximum Fury! That's beautiful. Overcharge is nice too. Pressing triangle and each overcharge, dealing massive damage and greatly filling ATB. Once it's used, it needs some time to recharge before it can be unleashed again. Press triangle again while it's recharging to fill it faster. Press triangle after using an ability or sand attack will greatly fill the gauge. So you should start using it and then use other attacks to... I see. Well, in the meantime... Hell yeah. Ain't got nothing on me. I love the victory poses. Lightning materia. And our resident goodest boy, Cloud. I wonder how to use Cloud. So we already know this. Braver and Triple Slash, yeah. Uh, let's use Triple Slash. Just like that, okay? Uh, yeah. 
Operator to Punisher mode. Move slowly, but at least powerful attacks. Level up there. Fire materia. All right, and beginners hall. Two person battles for Cloud and Bear. Participating in training exercises designed to teach novices the basics of combat. I ain't no novice. Press the square to attack an enemy. Yeah, we already know how to do this. You told us how to do this. A to B gauge fills gradually over time. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Hold L1 to press one of four actions for command shortcuts. R3 to uh, lock onto a specific target. Take the lead. All right. Watch and learn. Switching to a different character will sometimes provide an advantage. Ooh. Yeah. Certain abilities such as triple slash and focus strike could be used to take down foes in midair. Ah, that's cool. How did you miss? That's it. Barry, you disappointed me. Yeah. <laughs> can attack an enemy's weak point to deal massive damage. Certain abilities like Focus Thrust, Focus Shot, and Focus Strike can quickly fill the Stagger Gauge. It's on you. And once it's staggered, it's gonna do a lot of damage. Man, I should really make this its own episode, huh? Uh, okay, Know Thine Enemy. Three-person battle once you pick your team, engage, and simulate combat against a pack of fiends to more thoroughly analyze their behavioral patterns. Uh, enemy skill materia and sonic boom. Oh my god, there's enemy skill. Co conditions. Don't die. Oh, let's do our, our dream team. By dream team, I mean the people I'm using right now. So these still seem like pretty weak enemies. Yeah. We didn't die! Hooray! That it? That was really easy. I love the growl he makes. 
enemy skill materia. Enemy skill. Acts assess enemies across various regions to unlock special challenges in combat simulator. Oh, that's a great way to get the enemy skills. Oh, that's so much better than the actual way. Uh, default skill Sonic Boom, Sonic Boom, Sonic Boom deals wind damage and grants bravery and faith will always be available as long as the materia is equipped. That's great. I'm a big fan. I'm a big fan. Completion time. I don't know. Healing materia two. Okay. Do do do. We just got to beat the enemies here. Hey dudes. Round one of five? Wow. Okay, so this is a uh, d uh, don't die type of thing. Good news, these enemies are still weak. So I have to remember to assess every enemy I come across now. Evil dude. Triple slash is just great. Like, it's great against enemy hordes, you know? And apparently against flying enemies too. Especially since I just kind of warp around. assess you guys yeah I think I already assessed them but I may as well like assess the enemies I'm fighting here right if, if they're presented to me you know Fancy music, Grasslands Wolf. Okay, well, I'm gonna assess you also then. Uh, stocks of planes, hunt in packs, prey not only on wild animals, but occasionally livestock and people too, weak to ice! Alright. So it's my turn? Throat clamp thing. Alright, guys. Alright. Uh. Get away. I'd keep my distance if I were you. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, no. Can you take okay. Leave it to me. Yeah, the enemies kind of like uh, target the you know, the person that's in the lead, which is okay. That's fine. One. Yeah, man, these guys are actually you know things that I need to worry about, perhaps. I, perhaps I mean no. So long. Aha! So long, me Bowsy. <laughs> Nothing to it. Nothing doing, indeed. He said nothing to it. Uh, healing materia, two stars. Right, so I think that's everything that we can physically do right now. God, we're 30 minutes into the episode. So I'm gonna make the executive I decision. I expression that you're eager for more. Yeah. I'm gonna make the executive decision uh, to uh, <laughs> have a different, um... okay, so we don't have any data right now. 
uh, have, uh, have a different uh, uh, ongoing episode for world intel. after this <laughs> and make this a mini episode. Um, or not even a mini episode. It could just be a regular episode. We did things. It was important. Uh, let's just equip the material we got. Okay, so what do you have? You have a regular healing. I'm going to replace your fire with the fire and ice materia. And this... Uh, I'm going to give you HP up. Red, you have poison. I'm going to give you something useful. And... For now... I'll give that to you for now. And Aerith, you have wind. I'm going to give you the healing materia too that we just got. And is there... Can I give you something better? No. Why don't you have that equipped? Uh... Bum. Let's give you enemy skill. Let's level that up a little bit. Although, if you have that, I'm gonna switch this with lightning. Poison, fire, fire! Okay. I feel a little better about my little setup over here. Um. So yeah, that's, you, so that's from what I've observed thus far, the ones in this region have a habit burrows. of. So if you spot a burrow, huh. who knows what sort of you can dig you up things find. with chogobos. So let's just make sure nothing unlocked for whatever reason. Okay, so we did everything we can so far here. We needed to defeat a bunch more enemies and assess more enemies in the grasslands. Okay, that's I like those requirements there. That's like actual requirements to do something. Um, but yeah, I think I'm actually going to end off this episode here. I really thought they were gonna I've be doing chocobo things, but of late. yeah. I'm certain, however, a veteran mercenary like you would never abandon a task. I know you must be busy, but I'd appreciate your help. Listen, I don't need the snark kid. Uh, but next time on Final Fantasy VII, we're gonna go ride a chocobo. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye, everybody. Bye-bye.